Okay, fantastic. Well, we're getting started. Your first new representatives into the business. You did a great home meeting the other night. I was so excited to be there. We had a lot of people. It was really great. It was. And ladies, welcome aboard. Congratulations. Thank you. You're going to be her first representatives, and you're off and running and creating your own business inside of ACN. Are you excited? Very. Okay, great. Well, this is going to be what we call our launch uh, process. So we're going to be launching your business today. I'm really excited to do that. It's my favorite part of the whole business because now you're, it's your first day in ACN. So we're very excited by that. And what we're going to do is go over our launch document with this form. It's two pages, and we're going to go through it. It's going to take us a couple hours, but I'm now giving you the keys to your financial freedom. That's what I'm going to be doing. It's really exciting. Cool. Okay? Are you very, excited? Very. All right, great, because today we're going to take a couple hours, and we're going to go through the whole process of how to properly launch a representative. Okay? She's here to watch and learn because she's here to watch how we launch you into the process so that in the future she'll be able to launch her own representatives into the business because what we're creating is a perpetually growing organization that grows without us and how we do that is by teaching people the process so imagine she's now going to learn how to launch somebody into the business and then if you bring in people we'll launch them and she's going to watch and learn and slow so forth and so on and so the organiz the process keeps continuing so isn't that great so imagine one day you've created an organization that grows without you that cool? That's very cool. That's what we're creating. That's what we're building. Okay. That's why this launch process is so important. So we got to make sure we do it right. It's going to be two hours of a lot of information. I don't expect you to get everything that I'm going to tell you. I really don't. But there's a lot of information I'm going to I'm going to partake to you. Learn it. Take whichever you can from it. We're going to teach you a lot of the basics of the business. It's going to be a lot of fun. There's a lot of intense information. Okay. Ready to begin? Ready. Ready? Ready. All right, let's go. All right, so let's look at the first launch document. The first part of this launch document, and by the way, never, never, never launch anybody into the business without going through this first. Okay. It's a criteria in our business that we have. So everybody that comes into the business, they, they must go through this whole process because we want to teach them, right? We're not going to bring somebody into our business and not teach them properly because we're doing them a disservice. Fair enough? Fair. Okay, good. So the first part of our launch document is filling out the basic information, right? So you're gonna fill out the basic information. So you already have her information. So write it down anyway in the top. She's your sponsor. She's my sponsor. So it's Angela, write down her name, write down her phone number, and write down her email. Very good. And then you're gonna write down your upline executive team trainer. Okay. Okay, and then your upline executive team leader, and then your upline executive team coordinator. So you're gonna write down all their information. Okay. So okay. that way, uh, you know who to call for support. So in case she's not available or I'm not available, we have a whole support team available here to help you out because we're here to help you. Okay. Right? Because you're in business for yourself but not by yourself. That is very important to us. Okay? Mm -hmm. Okay, great. Okay. Now, the next section we're going to cover is all the telecommunications bills you brought with you. Mm -hmm. I want you to write down here all the people, all the companies that you, all the services that you have in your home. Okay. So write them all down, okay? All the services that you have, your cell phone provider, your home phone provider, your television provider, all your providers, write them all down. Excellent. And that's gonna help us after determine how we're gonna be able to transfer your services over, save you some money, and get paid on your old services, plus get you qualified and get you going into the business. Okay. Okay? Fantastic, that's really great. Now, uh, the next section we're going to cover is to understanding why you want to do this business. Listen, you're a very successful businesswoman. Uh, Nicola, you're in school and learning and getting ready to go into a new career, so we're excited for that. And so we're really excited to have you going into this business. So I really like to know, like, what is your driving force behind you getting involved in ACN? For me, it was I wanted a change of my life. I was tired of the of the you know owning the business and the business owning me and being able to provide my family with a better life and to retire my parents. That's what really motivated and has been instrumental in me not quitting ACN mm -hmm. and keep going at it because I wanted something that was going to motivate me every single day. So what, I want to know what I'm supporting you in. What are we supporting you in in your business? What is it that you ultimately want to accomplish by being in ACN? What do you want to achieve? That's, that's pretty easy for me. There were two things. One is the time situation. We own our own consulting company, as you know. So we spend a lot of time. Uh, owns us. We don't own it. So we're looking for more time, my husband and I, to um, be able to travel and have a little bit of freedom. But we also have three kids in our family and one special needs child. So we want to be able to provide for them as well. We want our kids to 
be involved in a, a, a business that's less traditional since they're not interested in traditional business, but we don't want them living paycheck to paycheck either. Got it. Well, so you're very clear what you want. Mm -hmm. Excellent. So what I want you to do is write all that down okay. really nice. Well, I'm going to ask Nicola the same question. So Nicola, why do you want to be in this business? You heard what your mom said, right? What would you like to get out of being and owning ultimately your own ACM business? Ultimately, I'd like the freedom to travel and do all the things that I want to do that maybe what uh, maybe certain jobs that I'm looking into now wouldn't provide me enough money to do those kind of things. Like what? Well, what would you like? Give me an I'd example. I'd like, <laughs> like to shop. I like got it. How old are you, Nicola? 28. 28. Okay, got it. So you like to shop. What else would you like to do? Travel. Travel? Yeah. Okay, great. What else would you like to do? Um, I want to just have time more than anything to do those things and spend time with my family and Sherry mentioned that my sister's special needs and one day I'd like to be able to have her around me and I can spend time with her and provide her things that she may not be able, able to provide for herself. Very good, Nicole. So write that down as well. That's very good. Okay, excellent. Angela, you heard what they, what they, what they want, right? So it's, we're going to help them achieve that, okay? Of course. So you want to write down even what they want sure. and for yourself so you're, you'll always know what you're supporting them in, okay? okay? Now, here's the question I have for you. Are you prepared to make the sacrifice that's going to take? Because it's going to take a sacrifice, right? This is not a get-rich-quick scheme. It's, that's not what this is, okay? Are you prepared to do what it's going to take to make that happen? Because in reality, it's going to take some effort and time and because you're already busy, right? So you can have that. You can absolutely have that if you are willing to make a sacrifice to make that happen. So here's my question. Are you willing? Yes. I How am about you, Nicola? I am living. Are you good? That's what it's going to take a sacrifice because I will remind you of that. Okay, when you say ah, I don't feel like it anymore, I don't want. I'm going to remind you. Okay, because that's what does so take a I. sacrifice. <laughs> <laughs> okay, and so was she. Okay, got that. She's going to remind you too. Okay, but that's what we're a team. We're here to work together and make this happen together. We're building our dream team. Is that cool? Mm -hmm. That's very All right, cool. cool. Okay, great. So here's what we're going to do. Now I'm going to explain to you financially how we're going to do that. I'm going to explain to you the compensation plan. This is the most important part of our business is to understand we get paid and how to build your organization. Okay? This is very, very critical. So I'm going to go over the compensation plan with you so you're clear about how that, what that's going to take. Okay? Mm -hmm. Because if you don't know how to get paid, how, how do you know how to build your organization? You don't. You don't. Right? right? So let's go over the compensation plan now. Now explain the compensation plan powerfully. Explaining the compensation plan is a key part of launching a new representative properly. The key aspects include the following. Number one, keep it simple. Do not get overly complicated. Imagine you're talking to a four-year-old child when you're explaining the compensation plan. For most new representatives, it could be overwhelming. Number two, be excited. We have the most lucrative marketing plan in network marketing history, so show your enthusiasm. Number three, Explain the importance of a representative being qualified in regards to the bonuses and the compensation plan and so that a new representative coming in can understand that without getting qualified, nobody gets paid. Number four, ask them how much money they want to make in the next 60 to 90 days. Be clear on what their goal is, what their plan is, because we're now going to be supporting them on how much money they want to make. And then explain how the ACN bonuses will help them make the money they want to make and create a plan for them how to do that. Number five, ACN each month has an incredible quick start bonus. Explain the bonus and how they can achieve it as part of their plan of how much money they're going to make in the next 60 to 90 days. It is key to explain the compensation plan powerfully. Why? Because, number one, it gets new representatives thinking revenue and making money. We want to put the new representative in the mindset that they will be making money with ACN very quickly. Number two, it explains the importance of getting qualified and regards to making money. Number three, the new representatives will be inspired into action. When you've explained the compensation plan powerfully, they'll be more excited to call people, to call their warm market, to call their friends, to call their family, to show them how lucrative the ACN opportunity is and to show how excited they are of having joined the business. They're going to be very excited to get started and get qualified because now they realize if they are not qualified and people come and join their business, they will not get paid. They will not earn the bonuses and they will not make money. So getting the new representative excited about the compensation plan now sets a strong foundation for the rest of the launch and puts them powerfully into action. So now we can move forward with the launch. We can teach them how to invite people properly. We can schedule their home meetings. 
we can get them signed up for the ACN business and get them qualified because now they know what they are building. So um, this is how the compensation plan works, okay? And I want you to learn this. I want you to keep learning it. I want you to really understand this, okay? It's very important that you learn how to build your organization and be able to teach it as you launch people into the business, okay? So what, whenever you can study the compensation plan, you're going to have to do that, okay? Okay. All right. Now let's get, the, let's get to work. Let's get, this is where the rubber meets the road. It all starts with creating your contact list, okay? Your contact list is going to make you a lot of money. So this is the most overlooked tool in ACN and the most critical tool in our business, okay? Because your warm market list already has the people to make you successful. We just have to get to them. We got to get them to see the information because if they see it, you know, they're going to love ACN, mm -hmm. okay? So what I want you to do is write down all your top contacts, okay? I want you to write down 100 names, okay? And I want, you, I want your top 30 and then everybody else. Okay. And top 30 meaning people that are already successful. We're going to go after the most successful people you know, the happiest, most positive people you know, people that are already successful in life because we found they're the ones that are going to explode your business the fastest they want. So let's go after them and then everybody else. So we're not going to exclude anybody else. We're not doing that. We're going to bring in as many people as we can that are already successful at the beginning because that will get you the biggest jump start into your business. Okay, So I want you to start writing down everybody you know, that, uh, that is, first of all, successful, business owners, maybe people that have already done network marketing, write them all their names down, okay? okay. And then everybody else. So I want you to write down as many names as you can. Your goal is 100 for today, okay? Okay. okay. Go ahead. Congratulations on writing 100 names. That's fantastic, okay? Now, I want you to go after your top 30 really fast. So the top 30 you wrote down, we're going to go after them first and get them to all your home meetings, okay? Okay. And then we're going to start working the whole list, and then you're going to keep adding to your list. Your ultimate goal is 200 people. That's your ultimate goal is have 200 names on a list with phone numbers. You're going to work it. You probably won't get through all of them. But why I want you to have that many, because think about this. I never want you to get attached to any one person coming into your business. Robin might come into your business tomorrow. She might not. It doesn't matter. Because mm -hmm. imagine if you go to talk to 30 people and six people came in and none of them were Robin. Would you be okay with that? Yes. Yeah, you'd be happy with that, right? Mm -hmm. It'd be perfectly fine. Mm -hmm. So I don't ever want you to worry about one particular person coming into your business because one person will never make your business. They won't or break your business. Remember, this is a long-term process and we, we're going to play the numbers. Okay? okay, it's a numbers game. Okay, so the more people you can get in front of, the more people you can show the business, the faster you're going to go this through. Just like Angela did, right? Angela had a lot of people at her home meeting, some of her friends, some of their families, some of the people that she thought for sure were going to sign up. They didn't. But then you guys came and you guys signed up, right? Which is exciting. <laughs> so you never know what's going to happen into the business, okay? All right, great. Okay. Excellent. Now, let's schedule your first meeting, okay? We're going to schedule three in the next seven days, okay? So... Uh, we're going to do a meeting either at 6.30 or 8.30, so you're going to pick one. I'll take out my calendar now, and we'll line up, and let's schedule meet three meetings, okay? okay. And we can pick a weekend. We can pick a weeknight. It's whatever is going to work. If you think you can get somebody to your home in the afternoon, we can do that as well. It's completely up to you. We're here to support you. Angela's going to be here and help us out as well, so we'll all be here together to work together, okay? okay. So let's pull out our calendars. Let's get our agendas, and let's okay. go. <laughs> Excellent. Yeah. Fantastic. All right, guys. So let's look. And let's look at our next dates. Okay, so your goal is to show the business to 15 people in the next 7 to 10 days. That's your goal, okay? And so we can start building your organization really fast. Okay, you want to get people in front of me as, as fast as possible so we can get them into your business and get them excited about ACN. Because we know, listen, this, is, this business is brilliant. So we're going to love showing people the business. The more people you can get to show it to, it's like having parties, right? How many people can get to your party? She doesn't like parties. You don't like parties, Nicola? <laughs> you're going to learn to like parties. <laughs> you're you're going to have fun. Oh, you're, you're a party animal. Party. I got it. You're the party animal. I got it. So we're going to have some fun, okay? <laughs> this is good. So that's all this is. All this is, just think about throwing parties, but parties to make money. That's really what we do, okay? We're going to have some fun, okay? Cool. Awesome. Okay. Now that we've got the three uh, meetings scheduled for you, the next thing we're going to go over is your script. So we're going to teach you how to properly invite people to come see an ACN meeting, okay? And so this is where people actually can have extraordinary success in ACN or fail miserably. If there's one skill you need to learn in ACN, it's how to properly invite people. 
So Angela practiced and practiced and practiced and practiced. She practiced with her dolls. She practiced with her animals, her pets. You did a good job, by the way. And she did great, right? So and why, what had her do a great job? First of all, she was excited. She had conviction in her voice, and she was enthusiastic. She had the three elements required to properly invite somebody to see a presentation. So that's what it's going to take to come people to come to your home, okay? okay? And then she said very little. If you notice, she didn't say very much to you, right? No. I know. I know. It's good, okay? <laughs> she didn't get into a lot of detail, and here's why. The more detail you're going to give, the more questions they're going to ask. And the more questions they ask, the more you have to answer, and then there's more questions and more answers. Pretty soon you've done a five-minute presentation. They're confused. They think they're a telemarketer for 500 bucks. Mm -hmm. Okay, so they don't understand, okay? Right. Right. So, uh, listen, I've been doing this for a long time. I still don't tell people what it is over the phone because we just, you can't describe it. It's really difficult. So what I do is I say as little as possible. I imagine in my home I have a million dollars for them to collect. That's what I imagine. And what can I do to get them there to come see it with as little as possible? And if they don't get there, they're going to miss out on a million dollars. That's the way I relate to it when I'm inviting somebody to come see a presentation. And I get really excited. I get super excited. Okay? So that's what we're going to do. We're going to get super excited, and we're going to invite people. It's all your enthusiasm that's going to get people to come see the presentation. Okay. And saying very little. Okay? So here's a, a great script here that we're going to go over that gives you an understanding or idea or a sense of uh, how to properly invite people. Now that we read through the script, now we're going to practice. Okay, so you're going to practice inviting us to come, people to come see the presentation. Okay, okay? so we're going to practice 10 times. Okay. Okay, because I want you to feel comfortable and natural saying it. Okay, and I want you to put this in your own words. So I don't want you to feel stiff or robotic about it. Just be yourself. Be yourself when you're inviting people. If you call people dude, call them dude. If you call them dudette, call them dudette. Whatever you call <laughs> your friends, right? It's all up to you. Okay, but just be natural, be yourself. Don't be all strange and weird with people. At the same time, try and say as little as possible because um, one of the things we want to be responsible for is the less we speak, the more interested they become. Just understand that, okay? It's just a, it's a human factor issue, okay? okay. Mm -hmm. All right, great. So, ready to practice? Sure. Okay, good. So, uh, I'll go over it first just okay. to give you a sense of how we do it, like how I would invite somebody to come see a presentation, and then after that, uh, we'll uh, have you do it and practice with us, okay. okay? And you can practice inviting Angela, and then Angela, you can practice back and forth, a lot of fun. You guys can practice afterwards and have more practice. Because the okay. one thing I've learned, the more practice you make, the more natural it becomes, the easier it is to get people to come see a presentation. Okay. So imagine you got so good at inviting people to come see a presentation that on demand you can get whoever you wanted to come see a presentation. How cool would that be? Wow. That comes with practice. And we have people in our business that can do that because they practice and practice and practice. Because honestly, that's probably the hardest part of our business. If you can do that, you can do ACN pretty simply. Okay? Ready? Okay, Sherry, so I'm going to do it first, okay? okay. I'm going to practice, and then I want you just to be a regular person. I'm going to invite one of my friends. You're my friend, okay. Sherry. Okay. And then we'll do that. Is that okay? Sure. All right, right. So let's get pretend I'm calling you. Okay, ready? Ring, ring. Hello. Sherry? Yes. This is Franco. How are you? I'm good. How are you, Franco? Great. Great. Listen, have you got a minute? I do. Awesome. Listen, Sherry, I have a very, very, very important question to ask you. Okay. Uh, here's the question I have for you. Ready? Ready. Are you open to evaluating an opportunity to make money outside of what you're doing right now? Sure. Okay, great. I'm having a private and exclusive meeting at my home Sunday at 5 p.m. Can you make it? Private and exclusive? Yes, Sherry. Sure. Okay, what time? great. 5 p.m. Okay? Dress sharp. Don't be late. This is, you're going to thank me for the rest of your life. Oh, I'm intrigued. Okay, good. So don't be late, okay? Okay, I won't. Okay, I will see you then. Okay. Bye-bye. Bye. Pretty simple, okay? It's very, very simple. Now, start giving me a little bit harder time, okay? okay? If that's okay, you can start doing that. And So I'll call you again, okay. and we'll do the exact same thing again. Just a little, give me a little bit harder time. Okay. Just, you know, okay. That was good. You're very good. It was all awesome, but they're not all going to go like that, okay? It's <laughs> not. Okay, it's not. I'm sorry. I got bad news for you. Okay, I'm going to prepare you. Some people are going to be like, ah, it's not going to go like okay. that, okay? So, okay, ring, ring. Hello. Sherry? Yes. Hey, this is Franco. How are you? I'm good. How are you, Franco? Fantastic. Okay. Listen, have you got a minute? I did. Awesome. I have a very, very important question to ask you. Okay. Are you open to making money outside of what you do right now? Depends. I got it depends. But are you open to making money in addition to what you're doing right now? What, what's it about? 
Well, how am I going to make money? Well, before I tell you that, first I need to know if you're open to it or not. Because if you're okay. not open to it, I'm not going to continue the well, conversation. Well, I'm always open to making money. Okay, Frank, don't you know me? Uh, exactly. That's why I'm calling you. Because I know you're always open to making money, okay? I, I, that's, that, I can count on that, right? Yeah. So good. So if you're open to it, fantastic. I'm having a private and exclusive meeting Sunday at 5 p.m. Can you clear your schedule and be there? Sunday at 5? Yes. Sure. Okay, great. I'll see you then. Okay. okay. Dress sharp. Please don't be late. Okay. Got it. Thank you. Thanks, Frank. Okay, bye. Now, if you notice... She went from what is it to you saying yes. Why? Because first, I want to find out if she's interested in making money or not. Once we establish that, we move forward. We don't move forward until we establish she's interested in making money. Because once she's interested in making money, then we know where we stand. Okay? It makes it a lot easier. But what happens to a lot of people when they're inviting, they get right away, get into, well, it's, it's this, and it's got a video phone, and it's this, and it's technology, and it's... And you get all confused, right? So I don't move forward until I find out if they want to make money or not make money. Make sense? Yes. Okay, great. Now, that's one possible script. So we're going to, when you go to our team website, you can actually see here we have a whole variety of scripts you can use. Okay. So, for example, here's another script. Ring, ring. Hello. Is Sherry there? I'm Sherry. Hey, hey Sherry. Sherry. It's Franco. Franco. How are you? <laughs> Good. How are you, Franco? Fantastic. Listen, have you got a minute? I do. Okay, great. A very important question to ask you. Okay. Okay? So um, I just, I'm putting together a, a, a team to start a business project. Okay, I thought of you right away. I think this is right up your alley. Are you open to making money outside of what you do? What kind of project is it? Well, it's very exciting. First of all, are you open to looking at something extra in addition to what you're doing? Because if you're not, then I'm... You know, for I'm not, you, yeah. Okay, well, it's so more for you to make money, right? Oh, really? <laughs> okay. Because okay. okay, I thought of you right away when I saw this. Really? So I'm putting together a little dream team, and I want to include you on that. Dream team? A dream team. Wow, that sounds exciting. Are you in? I am. All right, good. Be, I'm having a private and exclusive get-together at my home Sunday at 5 o'clock. Can you clear your schedule and be there? Yes, absolutely. Okay, great. I'll see you then, okay? okay. Don't be late. Okay. Okay, great. Very simple. So that's another way of saying it, okay. okay? So you have different scripts and different ways of looking at it. Another great script I've got is that there's people that you look up to, like business owners, is another great script I've got. So imagine that you're going to be somebody I look up to in business, that you've done a lot of things, and you already have. You're like, you are a very successful business owner, a very successful consultant. So if I actually was calling you in reality, here's like, kind of like how she said it, right? Mm -hmm. I'm going to invite you the same way. Okay. So I'll say, Sherry, this is Franco. Have you got a minute? Yes. Great. Sherry, listen, I'm calling you. First of all, I'm a little nervous. you got to know I'm a little nervous in calling you. Oh, don't be nervous, Franco. Oh, I appreciate that. But, you know, I have a lot of respect for you in business. You've done so many amazing things with your career. You've consulted with some of the top companies in the world. It's amazing what you've done for so many people. Thank you. You're, You're welcome. welcome. And uh, what I'm, I'm looking at a business project myself right now that I could really use your professional opinion on because it's something I'm excited about, and I think that your input would be incredibly invaluable to me. Can you clear an hour of your time Sunday at 5 o'clock for me to show you this? Oh, well, I'd be happy to help you out, Franco. Great. Right. If you can come to my house Sunday at 5 and I can get more detail on this, I would really, really appreciate it. You have no idea what a favor this would be to me. Oh, absolutely. I'll okay, great. Thank you so much. I really appreciate sharing. You're welcome. Okay? So that's someone you look up to. You can use that script with them. Very, very simple. Now, if you notice, these come naturally for me. Why? I practice them a lot. Okay, so practice, 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 practice. These will not come naturally for you at the beginning. So we're going to now spend the next you know, few minutes practicing the scripts that you want. Now, the other thing you want to know is whoever you're calling, you've got to know who you're calling, right? So if you're calling a successful multimillionaire and you're not, then you can't say to them, hey, I'm going to teach you how to make some money because <laughs> they're not going to look at you very seriously. Right. So whenever you're calling somebody, know who you are in relationship to them. That's very, and then pick the appropriate script that will work for them and then practice that script. Okay? okay. All right, good. So, and like family members, you might have to do a little bit differently. Like for family members, you might say something like, listen, uh, I'm just starting my little business, and uh, before I put a lot of time and money into it, I could really use your opinion. Could you be at my house for an hour Sunday? Okay. okay. That's one you can use for your close friends and family to come over on Sunday, 5 o'clock, and so you can after, we'll have a little bite afterwards or whatever. Okay. Okay? So there's different scripts for everybody. What's more important, though, is that you practice it now. Okay, so we're going to spend the next few minutes practicing these scripts so it becomes a little bit more natural for you. I don't expect you to be great at it at the beginning, but you will over time. Okay? And until it becomes natural for you. Okay. Okay? All right, great. So let's practice now. So, was that fun? That was fun. That was fun, right? You ready to go? Ready to make some phone calls? 
All right, guys, so we can call a couple people, and we're going to practice. We're going to call Robin right now, because you said you wanted to put Robin in front of me for tomorrow, so let's give her a call. Okay. And basically what you're going to say, say to Robin is say, Robin, I came across this incredible business opportunity. I need you to meet a gentleman tomorrow. And then you're going to edify me to Robin so she gets excited to want to meet me tomorrow, the earliest okay. convenience. So tell her whenever, we, what, what schedule schedule like Robin tomorrow because you need to meet this gentleman. This business project that I'm going to get involved in is unbelievable. You're going to love this. Okay? okay? Mm-hmm. And then you're going to edify me to her okay. and say the things that I'm going to teach you to say to her to me, okay? okay? And then we're going to invite her and we're going to have her meet tomorrow, okay? okay. Sound good? Sounds good. Awesome. Hi, Robin. This is Sherry. How are you? Great. Do you have a couple of minutes? Cool. Well, actually, I don't have a couple of minutes. I have just a, like four.